Come on. Are you following me? You are such an <laughs> idiot. Look at that. You have a torch head. You have a torch hat on. That's it. Come on. Are you the dumbest sheep I've ever met? Come on. You see me with sheep with wheat in my hand, right? You don't like seeds. Look at that. You're about to die just from being ugly. What is up, my peoples? DB Things back at you with another episode of Infinitude, and I am very excited to be back. I'm sorry it's been a week, almost two weeks now, since I've been able to put an episode out, and I do apologize. That is only because I was sick as a dog. Um, I think I got it licked, and so you know what? I got a lot to show you. I want to just jump right into it. I have installed a couple new mods, and uh, one is jammy furniture, so we're going to be able to make all sorts of fun stuff for the house, and especially the dishwasher and the, uh, what's it called there, the washing machine, so we can uh, restore our swords and our armor and all that good stuff, which is real nice. The other one is the clone craft mod. Um, we will get into that at another time, but it just allows you to create a clone of uh, yourself and any other sort of mobs like pigs and chickens and whatever and I have some really fun plans for that as well but um, I want to also show you around uh, at, to a little, I can't talk I want to show you a lot of things I've done off camera I realize that while I'm trying to keep this up this uh, series fun to watch that there hasn't been a lot of building going on and so that is precisely what I'm going to show you what I've done off camera so let's get right into that um, first of all I put a door in enough hiding behind dirt uh, I added some ladders uh, to give us an opportunity to go down from level to level instead of using those stairs every time and where this will take us first is to what I'm going to be calling my storage room so this is a uh, room down on the ground level um, that I will completely populate with chests full of stuff um, and we will not have to keep going upstairs every single time that we need something. I got doors on either side with pressure plates so that it makes it nice and easy. Uh, did up some stone in the furnace and made some, what is it, whatever this is, chiseled stone and uh, things are starting to look nice here. The big difference has to do, I'm looking down on purpose for the big drum roll reveal, is this my sorry about that my um, animal pens I've built a deck as you can see with uh, a structured sugarcane farm underneath which looks much nicer and a lot more of it and uh, I have double decker animal pens the third one on the end there I still have to finish I would do that on camera this is my auto wheat farm that you're already familiar with. Um, actually, the first thing I need to do, and I kind of forgot when I was upstairs, I need to equip myself with Rana, one of the other mob, um, sorry, one of the other um, helpers there from the familiars pack uh, mod. We used Navi to help us find diamonds, and now we're going to use Rana. Rana is absolutely amazing. She allows you to jump really high, and you take no fall damage. And let me tell you, it's very hard once you have used Rana for a while to go back to not using her. You get used to no fall damage. Uh, anyway, so I've already purchased her. Uh, let's see, Rana. Uh, she was seven experience points, as you can see and now I'm just going to equip her and you can see her there floating off to my right let's go ahead and put our fam guide back we don't need to carry that with us um, I did a little mining off camera as well let's see um, iron I wanted I needed iron I found an amazing ravine which I'll show you guys uh, pretty much underneath the house but off to the side a little bit absolutely amazing found a, a bunch of things 
Uh, the diamonds, I didn't find any more diamonds. Those we had from the last episode. I uh, found some gold, blah, blah. And uh, other than that, I got a, did a little bit of tree, tree trimming so that uh, I could get the wood I needed for those animal pens down there. So the, the first thing actually that I want to do is build uh, with some of that iron. I want to build the... Uh, dishwasher. I don't know why I'm having trouble remembering what the name of that stupid thing is. Um, but let's grab that iron and we have to decide where my kitchen is going to be. I want it down on the first level or, or the second level, something like that. But I'm not entirely sure at this point where. But that's okay. We can build it and move it later if we want to. Um, so let's figure out how to, how to do this stuff, okay? So let's look up dishwasher. There's the dishwasher. Uh, oh, and it's actually not very expensive. So six ingots of iron and two buttons. We can certainly manage that. We have our ingots. Let's cruise over here to the crafting table and make a couple buttons. Uh, stone, is it? Let's see. Uh, let's see... Where is the stone? There we go. I knew I'd cooked up some stone. Maybe it's supposed to be stone. And it is. One. Do they stack? Yes. Yes. Okay. And now back to the crafting table. Uh, I believe it was two buttons. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. Look it that dishwasher now honestly it'd be all fun to play house with a dishwasher and all but the real beauty is look at my uh pickaxe down there and my sword um the sword has a thousand more hits on it so that's all good but the pickaxe were down to like 200 hits so i really need to put those into oh you know what I know I'm gonna need something to fuel it and I'm guessing that's gonna be coal so let's grab uh, a whole bunch of coal and let's do this let's go down and not on this level let's maybe do it on this level um, oh omelet 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 alert bam oh all right uh, bup, 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 bup. I'll be honest, it's probably going to end up in an internal section, maybe this way, over there somewhere, but not sure. So let us, for the time being, let's just put it out here uh, in the middle of nowhere. Ready? Boom. We have a dishwasher literally sitting, sitting here in the middle of the room. <laughs> so let's right click it and yes indeed we need to fuel it with coal and oh let's do this yeah isn't that awesome so there's the sword we can do four at a time so there's the pickaxe and I don't even want to repair any of these stone things so let's uh I do believe this takes quite a long time let's wait and make sure that these arrows are getting at least some progress before we turn away come on come on oh there we go actually they don't turn white they disappear so we'll let that do its trick and while that's doing it let's uh since i don't have a pickaxe or a sword you know what let me let me just go show you more of the the animal pens what do i have do i have any wood because there is the one, you know what, Mr. Indecisive, I am going to go up and make a pickaxe out of stone um, or iron because I want to maybe take a look at the animal pens and, and maybe build that last one out here. Oh, I have the iron, and do I have any sticks? No, but I have wood, so let's make sticks. Okay. All right. So let's make some sticks. I don't need all of those. That's fine. 
Uh, we have some slabs. I know I'm going to need those. We have a gate. We also need fence. And let's make our pickaxe. And it looks like I'm going to need a new axe as well. Oh, let's see. And then we might as well... Oh, crap. I didn't want to grab another axe. Can I put that back? No, I can't put it back. I'm such an idiot. Um, should I make another sword? Mm, no, I'm not going to make another sword. I'd rather keep my, ar uh, my iron. I really should make some armor right now. That was the whole point of getting all that. So let's do that really quick. Um, iron, where are you? There it is. All right, we have 62. And let's see. Start out with boots. All righty. And then pants. All righty. And then let's see a helmet. Okay. And then. Do I have that right? Yep, there's the chest plate. <laughs> For the first time, and we're up to episode 7, am I actually going to have some armor on? So I believe if I just, over my hotbar, hold control and right click, it'll put it on. Look at that. So I highlight it, hold control, right click, highlight it, hold control, right click. I don't even have to hold control. Oh, okay. So there you go. I'm an idiot. I don't have to hold control. Um... Why is it that my armor didn't fill up? Is it just because it's made out of iron and only diamond would fill up? I mean, clearly it's not damaged. Hang on one second. Mr. 18 Brown is here in the background. Why? Um, Speak up. Di diamond would put it all the way up. So diamond would go all the way up and iron only goes that far? That's all right. That's at least going to, to help. All right. Um, real quick, folks, let us, first of all, let's go up and sleep. Well, I'm already there. Why don't I just go to sleep? Because everyone loves a nap, including DB things. Let's go show you. Well, we can check on our sword in the dishwasher oh it does turn white and look at that we're almost done um, oh, this is so great I can't tell you while I was mining how much I didn't want to lose and, and uh, lose my pickaxe and stuff listen here's the other thing in addition to just not losing the diamonds that go along with making these if you you know work your butt off and um, enchant these the dishwasher will restore it back to full health without losing enchantments. It's really fantastic. Um, all right. So what I want to do is I'm going to actually wait. I'm not going to wait because I made my other, uh, my iron version of the tools anyway. Um, but real quick, what was I going to say? I really don't know. So let's go down. By the way, I'll show you some Rana. Ready? Whee! Boom! Boom! No fall damage. And if I have a, a, a you know, like this, check this out. <laughs> now that is the way you get up onto a, a mountaintop. Ready? Watch. Well, okay, I missed. But if I wanted to jump up here, look at that. See, I can... Look at that, a sheep made its way into the pen. Oh, you know what? Another thing that just reminded me of. So these uh, double-decker animal pens, first of all, there's a gate over here for this side. And then up here, there's a gate at the top. And um, the other thing that comes with the jammy furniture mod, check this out. Check this out out if I can find it. Where is the furniture? Could I be any slower? Uh, 
the hell's going on? Clearly it's in here because we made the dishwasher. Oh, right here in front of me. Jesus. Okay, so here's the, the, the bathroom stuff. But this is what I was all excited about. Look at You can actually craft the heads of all these different things. So I'm going to be putting pigs and sheep and cow heads, chicken heads, around my animal pens of those types. And, they, and they're not even difficult. Look, if I take the, oh, for crying out loud, I didn't want to give myself 64 pig heads. Um, if I take a look at the crafting recipe for, I'll just type in head. These are all the different ones. The pig head is just um, eight pink wool, some raw pork chop, and some red stone. And they're all similar to that. Different color wool and then a couple other weird little things. Anyway, um, so that will be sheep, I guess. I, I added a crafting table down here. And you know what? I want to put the shears in here so that when I need to shear my sheep, I can just grab them right from here. Do that. And then I can actually store my wool right in there as well. I also added a crafting table built in as the bottom of the posts. I'm pretty proud of myself for that. I think it looks pretty neat. And of course you can use it just like normal. Uh, my second double decker over here will be for whatever, cows, pigs, something like that. And uh, my third one, like I said, I have to finish it out so that it matches. Um, I may build a fourth, um, you know, because we have sheep cows, pigs, and chickens as your sort of staples, and I may want to, may do a fourth. Okay, so let us just figure out what we've got here. We have some dirt so we can nerd pull up, and let us kind of jump in here. Uh, you know what? Let's jump back out for a second. Uh, let's see. All right. I have the frame all the way around. I need to get rid of two more blocks height-wise. Oh, by the way, look, that that's the thing, too, that I really love. Look at when you're with Rana. Usually building a, a nerd pole is, you know, pretty boring. But check this out. I, oh, oh, I ran my head into something there. I can get, you can build it very quickly with uh with Rana. So I thought that was pretty cool. Alright, let's jump up here and using our new pickaxe and you guys uh you know what I want you to do is you know do me a favor let me that pig just almost committed suicide. <laughs> he just jumped off the edge and I heard it splat. Um let me know if you like the idea of uncut videos as well, um, because what I'd be happy to do is, you know, continue to edit my videos and then maybe every fifth one or something, or maybe I'll get to the point of doing a couple a week and I can alternate between edited and uncut. Um, in a situation like this, I know a lot of people don't want to see just sort of clearing out of cobblestone and other people really I, I'm actually a fan of seeing everything I kinda get entranced when I watch other people's videos there's just a goat in here you guys are begging to be captive it's alright it's okay that's fine I can oblige I think you get uh... hide from goats right? No, I'll let them live Okay, what do we got here? One, two, three. You guys probably don't need me to count. And let's see. What the heck is going on? Is my brain deceiving me? I thought I... Oh, that's because of that. All right. Um, let's get rid of this. This, this. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to do that. That's all right. In fact, I think I'm going to have to go up another level in order to make the ceiling 
Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to go up one more level here to make the ceiling cobble or stone. Because I'm anal like that and I want it to match. So it was good that I did that. And we're going to be poking right out of the side of the mountain here on this. That's okay. Okay, goats. Yup, I hear you. I, I can hear you, I promise. Let's see if we can reach that. Come on. Yes. And what else? I need to get rid of this. Whoops. And then did I bring stone with me? Yes, I have some. Uh, by the way, if you see throughout uh, this sort of disgusting mishmash of stone and cobblestone usage, I promise I will... Uh, you know, make it more consistent at some point. I'm just trying to focus on on priorities right now. Um, let's see. Let's jump up here and add one more dirt to stand on. Whoops. I want my... And can I reach that? Eh, it's not going to let me. Damn it. Well, there goes that stone. Eh, let's see. Um, what else can I reach? Is that... Okay. That's about as far as it's going to let me go there. Okay. So let us add a little bit of a platform to stand on over here and break our stone back out and is that all the stone I've got okay so like I said now I'm going to use some cobblestone and I'll and I'll fix it I'll clean it all up at some point so it looks nicer and what have we got are we getting close so we need to go over there, and this is where Rana can come in. I don't need to build a pole just for this because I can jump up. <laughs> that is just absolutely awesome. Um, so let's break all this and get it out of our way so we can get our bearings and see where we are. Uh, let's see. I am going to have to do it here. And one, two, three, and four. All right, where are we? Hey, sheep, your pen is at the other end. You want to go in there? Huh? Huh? Here, I'll put wheat in my hand. Come on. Come on. Well, now you're on the other side of the fence. Come on. That's it. Come on. Ugh. That's it. Come on. Hey. Hey. Sheep. Hey. Are you really just pissed off still? That's it. Come on. Come on. Are you following me? You are such an idiot. Look at that. You have a torch head. You have a torch head on. That's it. Come on. Are you the dumbest sheep I've ever met? Come on. You see me with sheet with wheat in my hand, right? You don't like seeds. Look at that. You're about to die just from being ugly. Okay. Hey there, chicken. All right. Stay focused here, Dave. Stay focused. Um, let us... How, do, what, how? What is this whole thing built with? Okay. Do I have wood? Yes, I do. I'm sorry I'm so slow. Okay, shovel. And let's put our wood down here. And this needs to all be stone.
Ugh, oh, what a jerk. Is back up. Oops. That's what I meant to do. Um. Okay, folks. Let's take stock. Where are we here? I gotta get rid of that pole. I gotta fix that. I might as well just, like, go outside and fix that from outside. Where is it? Hey, sheep. Move. Move. Okay. Sorry I had to do that to you. Um, isn't this where the hole is? There we go. There we go. Uh, let's see. So this needs to be wood. And what I'm standing on should be stone, although it totally doesn't matter because you can't see it. And that should be stone as well. Let's go see if that's right. Yes, that looks right. Okay, so let's jump over here and get rid of that, 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 that. Probably because I won't be able to reach it. Whoops. Okay. Now, we need to fill in this with one and two. Replace those with wood and wood. Oh, wait. Do I still have... Oh, I still have four pieces of uh, stone here above my head. Let's just go up so that we can see where we are. And... Uh, Okay, one of each here. Okay, what do we got here? We're going to have to rearrange where those torches are to match over here. But I think our next step is to put in our uh, steps along with our what you call it there are slabs so we need to build some steps the beauty of having my crafting table right here and let's see I know I need one two three four five I think I need six so I'm just gonna make eight and we can break one piece of fence and then let's put our first step right here. Yeah, of course you're going to do that. Of course you're going to do that on the last one. Thank you. And is that how many we had here? One, two, three, four. Yeah, it looks like it. All right, so now let's do the slabs. Um, boom, boom, boom. And we'll call it an episode once we get these slab, you know, this animal pen in place. Um, I'm sure everybody else in the universe knew it. Um, I, You know, I didn't. But when you're placing a slab, it will place on the you know, upper or lower half of the block here that you're pointing at. So if I wanted this slab to be on the lower half, make sure I'm pointing at the lower half. If I want it on the upper half, which I do, make sure you're pointing at the upper half of the block. And let's finish this off. One, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, and two more. Oh, is that an omelet? We will never, ever, ever pass up an omelet because I'm an absolute freak, apparently. Uh, let's see. Let's put our fence up. And then I think I have a fence gate with me. Oops, 
think I have a fence gate with me. Yes, I do. I do, however, have to go build one more for down below. Cool. We got to position our torches. So let's go see how the torches need to be for the upper floor. Uh, let's see. They are just one and one. Since I'm with Rana, I can just jump over the fences. Um, so let's do this. First of all, take our torch back, put our axe in our hand, and we want to break that. And, by the way, we also want... Oh, why do I keep doing that? We want to put our shovel... down here so that we can do this, that, and there's one, and then this is our other one, we'll go right here, of course it's dirt behind it. And number two. So let's go down. Wait, what was this up here? Did I miss something? Yes, I did. Uh, let's put these in place. All right. And down here we have to do, well, let's see what they are. They are one and one, half, half, one, one, half, half, one, one. Okay, that's all fine and dandy. All right, so let's position this. And let's break this. Oh, it's stone. That's good. Let's break this. It's stone. Yes. Let's break this. It's dirt. Let's break this. It's stone. So this is where it really sucks. Now this this one is going to be the only one that's cobblestone. Um, anyway, let's do that. That. Ugh. There we go. Let's see how it worked. Uh, we also have to build one more fence gate. Let's see. What do we got? We have a stick, 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 stick. One, two. There we go. And let us break this, place that. Hey there, sheepy. You in the wrong pen. Um, and over here we have a sheep, a chicken, <laughs> a goat. And over here we have a naked sheep. <laughs> Oh, it's just funny. The worst animal pen population ever. Um, I should also probably do a better job of positioning these torches. Let's put one. Eh, let's put one torch here, and then let's see, maybe one below there. So right there. Yeah, I like that. So, and then like that, same thing over here, it was one, let's see, one, 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 break that, and then let's see, it was up, <laughs> I can't do it, there we go. Okay, let's go take a look. Let's look from afar, shall we? And we have our animal pens in place now. Things look good, right? right. Oh, I've got to put a torch over there. Otherwise, they uh, they look good. So let's put that torch in place. Hi, Panda Bear. Oh, omelet. By the way, I'm going to need those eggs for clone craft as well, which is why they won't all end up being omelets, but oh, let's see, one, 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 a 
Perfect, I believe. Let's make sure. Yes and yes. Okay, and then what I'll do is the pig heads and stuff. I, you know, I, I don't know if I'll just, you know, line the in inside here with pig heads and chicken heads and cow heads, or if I'll just put like one representative one on the back wall right here in the center. Right, you know, whoa, right there. But we'll see. We'll see how it works. What do you guys think? Uh, if you like these animal pens, if you think that they are a nice design, hit the like button. That's what I'll use on this video to uh, that lets me know that you enjoyed the uh, building of the animal pens. Okay. Um, if if you're new to the channel, uh, do me a favor and show me your support by subscribing. And uh, more episodes will be coming out as long as I know you guys are are interested in them. Okay. Omelet. Two of them. Well, I don't think we've ever picked up a double omelet. What up there, buddy? Just keep going here. Yeah, yeah. What am I bothering you? Let's see. Is there any more stuck in the water here? Yes, there is. And. Let's see. Oh, this is a lot of sugar farm. Sugar cane. And the reason, by the way, that I'm getting all of this sugar cane is, first of all, I think it looks pretty kind, pretty cool. Um, and there's something therapeutic about cutting down sugar cane. I don't know what it is, but I absolutely love doing it. Um, anyway, I want, obviously, to create lots of books so that I can hook up a really nice uh, enchantment room because now that I have the dishwasher and I know I won't lose my enchantments I can I can make some uh, I can get some nice enchantments going I, in particular I want uh, fortune because then we can go get those emeralds and diamonds or whatever else and uh, yeah so let's put by the way, look at this little thing. So with this, you know, obviously all my wheat drops to my hopper. And I can't look at my chest right now because if I click there, I just get the hopper. But I wanted a platform to walk on here. So all I did is I made these two platforms right here slabs so that from down here, I can look at my chest. So let me put, wow, we just got, we got exactly 100 sugar cane out of that um, let's see um, ba -ba -ba, put, well, you know what I'll keep that down here like that I'm actually gonna run my auto farm here as well so that I can replant And I love that. Yes, bird, you're loud. Yes, you are. Uh, let's go down and see what we got. 33 seeds. Very nice. And 64 wheat. How interesting is that, that it came out exactly at 64? And, whoops, I hate landing on it. And so I land on it again. Oh, and again. It takes a little bit of getting used to with Rana here because she jumps so high. You can just do a normal little tap and, and have her jump sort of a normal distance, but who wants to jump normal distances? All right, folks. Well, I certainly appreciate, as always, your, uh, your watching. Love your support. 
Love you guys. Um, hit that like button if you would. Please show me that you enjoyed the video if you did. And uh, subscribe if you haven't. And uh, let's do it. Let's just keep making more. And eventually the Infinitude world will uh, will really come out. And by the way, I can't wait to, to show you. But what I want to do with Clone Craft is I want to build on the other side of the mountain little villas as tributes. Mingya, yeah, these birds are loud. As tributes to the uh, YouTubers, and deck out their individual villas to uh, commemorate all that they've done for the rest of us playing Minecraft, and uh, and then with the clone craft, I'll make a clone of each one of them, and then we'll have uh, <laughs> go visit them. All right, folks. Thanks very much. I appreciate it. Thanks for. Watching. There's the turkey.